Follow, uh, continuing to follow breaking news, a school shooting at Appalachia High School in Winder, Georgia. News Nation's Elizabeth Pran is live at the scene for us there in Winder. Elizabeth, what can you tell us? Yeah. Yeah, Nicole, absolutely a devastating here. Still very, very chaotic, still very fluid. We just heard from the sheriff holding a press conference. There are a number of things that they won't confirm. They hope to hold another press conference at 4 p.m. What they can confirm is that there is one suspect in custody. We do not know that if that is a juvenile. We do not know if that is perhaps a faculty. We also know at least one person has been transported to Grady Medical Center, very well known for its trauma. We also know that there were multiple injuries. However, the sheriff at this time Time would not confirm the reports that there were casualties on the scene. To paint the picture for you, Appalachia is a large high school. We're talking 1,900 students uh, in Barrow County. This is about an hour outside of Metro Atlanta, so to visualize this area. It's a beautiful, sleepy town, rolling hills, white picket fences. In fact, when I was on the way to the scene here, Nicole, there were cars lined up, just parents working to reunify. And that is one of the things that the sheriff told us during the press conference right now they're focusing on reunification this is very very fluid and also investigating what happened here uh, to give you some perspective of the scene as i mentioned gpi G G uh, georgia bureau of investigations is on scene uh, fbi is on scene state and local everyone working to get to the bottom of this investigation what the sheriff told us again as i mentioned 4 p.m there will be another press conference nicole where we wait to hear for some more information and update on some of those injuries and of course uh, we are looking to confirm or deny the reports of casualties on scene. Nicole? Yeah, absolutely. All right. Elizabeth Pran live there at Appalachia High School for us. Elizabeth, thank you.